The, the struggles that I see people dealing with, it's, it's a very large variety. Um, there's, there's trauma from childhood. There could be relational issues in their current life. Um, sometimes people come in for anger management or dealing with anxiety. So it's, it's a really big scope that people come in with. Yeah, uh, I see as a couple of the greatest needs here at Genesis with you know people bringing in or, or fear and shame. And I and I look at and you can look at those as anxiety and depression as well. I believe that fear uh, is something that uh, causes us to to move towards our self. Like there's a, a place of fear of the unknown of of pain and if i believe that i'm going to i'm going to experience pain and i don't like pain i'm scared of pain whether it's relational or physical or whatever i might be it might it might cause me to withdraw and not encounter um, the fullness of what what life is and what i believe god wants for us shame it is a withdrawing again. It's a withdrawing of uh, from from something fuller and greater. Uh, you know, the, what's coming into my mind right now is is shame. That's outside the boundaries of what we're designed, and we move to those darker places because we fear. And again, it feels like those two are tied together: fear and shame. It feels like we're moving away from the fullness of what God wants from us. But, for whatever reason, we we kind of stay in those places because um, we feel like they're safe places, but it's a false safeness. I think what is so powerfully unique about what Genesis is doing is it's providing counseling with godly truth for people. I think that is the most soul replenishing, is to provide a path for, for people to know and understand that God is walking alongside them in this, and for them to be able to wrestle with doubt and hurt and pain, both with God, with others, within themselves, to be able to face those painful inner experiences so that they can move toward the life that they want rather than trying to avoid or run from it. Counseling is really all about the therapeutic relationship. And so initially it's about establishing that rapport. And I try to go about that with an attitude of uh, co coming into that, those first sessions with really wanting to know and understand and listen well. And, and so that I'm helping create a safe and secure environment for the, the people coming into my office. And there's a lot of, just a lot of people coming in wanting something to come out of their time, wanting something to um, change in their heart or their life or their relationships. I work with children and I work with ages three through 18. And so with kids, I have toys in the room and I have a dollhouse. And I, I usually, when they come in and sit down, I pull out a bag that has toys and fidgets in it um, because uh, a counseling relationship is most effective when a person feels comfortable. And so usually in a session or two, you can build rapport pretty quickly. I think what's special to us is that we're, we're a group together. And I feel like that's a unique thing. We're a group of believers together who really are moving together towards people's hearts. Um, and I, and I, I, I want to make sure that it's known that that doesn't begin in our office. That begins when people walk through the front door and they're greeted by a warm face and a warm smile and 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 it begins there and then it, it, it and just the way they're cared for here at genesis is something something different i feel and then and then there 
that really starts the therapeutic alliance, really, from, from walking through that first door into our office. And then we can begin to, to, to step into the, some of the heart work. But without that piece, I don't feel like, it, it can be moved into, of course, but it, it feels like it, it's, it's a group of people that, are, that just love people. And I think that makes us unique here at Genesis.